Hey, it's Ryan Cavino with RyanCavinoRealEstate.com bringing you your Cambridge Mass Mass weekly price change, bank owned, short sale, and new construction update. So first things first, let's take a look at what had a price change in the last seven days because we know we highlight the actives and the under agreements on Wednesdays. Let's take a look at the price changes in the past week. So just in the condos this week, we got 5551 Franklin Unit B. This is a bank owned. Um, this is the basement unit dropped to 245. It is the building is really nice. I've known this property for a while now after seeing this unit. And the other three units in there are really nice. And then this unit is the basement and just uh, a little bit lackluster. I think that a two bedroom, 616 square feet. I think ultimately this is going to have to go in the low twos, the high ones. Another price change is 30 Cushing Street, Unit B. This is a uh, a property that's two bedrooms, one bath for 249 and this is pretty nice. It is a 848-square-foot um, unit, and it has a off-street parking and um, has its own laundry room, but appears to be a basement unit, which is okay, but still 249 a little bit uh, high, and then we have 6872 Howard Unit 2 for 329.9. This is an 840 square foot true two bedroom condo with equally spacious bedrooms. It's really in a, a cool area, close to walking distance of Central Square. Looks like the walls have been repainted and the floors maybe have been refinished. Uh, it appears to be in nice shape. Kitchen's a little bit older and elementary. Nothing really uh, sophisticated about it. Not a lot of counter space and um, not really some terrific flooring but 329 could be a good rental for somebody or if you wanted to renovate and do some work to it you could probably get in the low, low fours for it or somewhere along there um, but it does need a little bit of work if you wanted to do that and then we have 40 Fenno Street unit 40 it is a price change at 479 it's uh, it does have an, uh, an accepted offer, but they're waiting for the inspection and the purchase and sale agreement. So, not sure why they would drop the price after they get the ins after they have the price change, or the offer was accepted after they dropped the price and it's still in price change mode. Um, we don't know, but it's a really cool 1,400 square foot, two bedroom, two bath, nice back deck. Um, kitchen's a little bit dated. But um, it does have some pretty cool features in this unit. You can see the living room, dining, kitchen area here. And this would be great if this wall was taken down right here, the top part. And uh, here's the upstairs master. So that's our price changes. Let's take a look at all of Cambridge and see if there was anything in the bank-owned department. If you had an activity, if anything went under agreement or sold, and nothing, all this stuff has been here before. We've seen these Howard Street building once for two fourteen, once for three twenty two. They're both bank owned units one and two, and uh, unit one is priced incredibly high at three hundred twenty two thousand, while the other is at two fourteen. Um, the other unit is five fifty one Franklin. We just looked at, and this single family on eleven Seventh Street is a uh, kind of like a row house. It's owned by HUD, and there's no parking. And it does need a little bit of improvements to bring it back to life. Let's take a look here. And see what the short sales. We have five. All active. Nothing under agreement. Nothing sold. This 10 Museum weighs over by the Museum of Science. It is a uh, almost 1,100 square foot, two bedroom, two bath. Really nice looking condo. It uh, has some trendy painting and some modern finish work. And uh, that needs lender approval, but it is uh, definitely a pretty cool building. We have 38 Linian Street, Unit 3, 389. Uh, still needs short sale approval. Pretty decent 755 square foot unit. A little bit of a dated kitchen, but uh, certainly in a popular area. Uh, 135 Inman Street, Unit 7. This is like your traditional um, post and brick condo complex. 299, two bedroom. Has an accepted offer waiting for some other uh, contingencies to be met and maybe some backup offers 51 Sherman this is a four bedroom all the bedrooms look to be on the small side and it is on for 249 for a four bedroom 
which could be a good rental for somebody if they get it a little bit less than that, maybe around 200, 220. And 309 Elm Street, Unit 1, and this is a um, another accepted offer, three bedroom, they're probably leaving it on the market just to get more offers in case some of them have to back out due to waiting so long. So we got that, now let's take a look And some new construction stuff in the condos. Nothing, no activity going on. Uh, let's get rid of that. 32. So there's 32 no, new converted condos on the market in Cambridge. Let's take a look at the most expensive one 10 McTernan Ave. It's at Dana Park Place. And this is a new structure. Looks like it might have been a church or a, a courthouse or some sort of school building before. But there's a lot. There's a lot of stuff that's being converted and or being built. So that is your new construction short sale bank owned price change update for the week ending March 1st, 2011. Give me a shout, Ryan at RyanCavino.com if you have any questions. Bye.